The remains of former staff of the Ghana Broadcasting Corporation and legal practitioner Mrs. Judith Brifo have been interred at the Usu Cemetery in Accra. A burial service was also held in her honor at the Hosanna Temple of the International Central Gospel Church at Teshi. Mrs. Judith Brefo was born on Tuesday, 23rd May, 1967, to Mr. John Osei Wusu of Blessed Memory and Madame Vida Idum Kwapong, the third of four children. Sweetie, as she was affectionately called, had a primary education at the University Primary School at Legon. She then proceeded to Majorsda Preparatory School for her common entrance examination. She gained admission to St. Monica Secondary School in Ashanti Mampon in 1979 and completed in 1984. After her GCE O-level examination, she gained admission into a Palm Secondary School to pursue her sixth form education from 1984 to 1986. She later obtained a diploma in public relations and advertising at the Ghana Institute of Journalism. Mrs. Judith Brefo was employed by the Ghana Broadcasting Corporation in 1992 where she rose through the ranks to become a senior manager. While at GBC, Mrs. Brefo had the opportunity to further her education in various institutions, including the University of Ghana, University of Westminster in the United Kingdom, and the Ghana Law School. She was called to the bar in 2012. In 2015, she left the corporation to practice full-time law with the law firm Ejapin Akrasi and Co. Mrs. Judith Brefo passed on at the Tema General Hospital on the 26th October 2016 while seeking medical attention. Members of the Bar Association and some staff of GBC paid glowing tribute to the late Judith Brefo. that my learned friend, Mrs. Judith Brefo, has been elevated to practice in the high court above. Brefo, Mrs. is a time stealer and a very diligent lawyer. I will not object to this case being stood down for even one hour. In a sermon, the head pastor in charge of the Hosanna Temple of the International Central Gospel Church, Pastor Simon Tenglafu, said time is of essence in life and therefore humanity must adequately prepare for the inevitable. Let us pray to God. Father, I want to return to my first love. It is not lost yet. The only time it is lost it is when you are in the casket like this. But whilst we are still breathing, there's abundance of time that will renew our relationship, our faith, our aspiration, and our focus on heaven. She passed it. We passed it. All storms of life, she passed. All the people she met, they testify. The people testify. This is indeed a Christian, a good testimony of Christ Jesus. The remains of the late Mrs. Judith Brefo was later interred at the Osu Cemetery. She survived by a husband and two children.